social banking from GT Bank. Anywhere, anytime, any device. Hi guys, my name is Onos and we're here for Giddy Up Season 2. If you didn't know about Giddy Up, it's an exciting new series from Indani TV and we are here at the Genesis Deluxe Cinemas to have an exclusive screening of the first few episodes. Yellow cards are people who talk too much, like you, and we don't need people talking crap here, so please speed us up, yeah? Okay, um, guess what? Um, I've got something you like and it's called a red card. Red cards are for people who talk a lot of nonsense, so uh, you should get off the orange carpet right now. So disrespectful. Anyways, I'm Toyin and he's Onos. And yeah, I'm here. Onos. Hi guys. Why are we here? We're here for the exclusive screen ah, of Giddy Up. Sorry. How are you feeling about tonight? I'm nervous, eh? And um, I'm looking forward to it. I'm really excited. So it's good energy, it's good nervous energy. I mean, I'm meeting with. Nigeria's top actresses and celebrities, so and I'm really excited to be here. I never expected, <laughs> I never expected this to happen. She never expected it. I came to support Ade Soa, so I'm very excited. I'm actually nervous. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm nervous. This is actually my first premiere, like my first TV show premiere. So it's a big one. Oh, so you've been premiered this version. <laughs> I'm so glad that he has ballooned into what he has become today. Like you know, this is unbelievable right now. This is. This is, this is what we should be doing for African TV right here. How did you get into character for Gideon? Um, yeah, that was really hard because the character that I play um, is a very spoiled rich girl. You know, a total daddy's girl and I'm quite the opposite. So I just had to look around Lagos a lot. There are quite a few spoiled daddy's girls around so I picked up a thing or two from them so that made my job a lot easier. But why do you think you've replaced the format with me? Well I think that um, Karibi is a phenomenal actor but I like the fact that as long as you're a good actor if there's the opportunity to be able to play something I'm all for whoever does it best should do it. So basically you're the better actor. No, I haven't said that. <laughs> why did you drop the Obi role? We want to know tell us let us know. Uh, why did I drop the over? You know, timing, um, you know, creative differences, to be honest. Um, I, I, I do a lot of work outside film and TV. I run a business, so I also have to pay attention to that. But I think I will surprise people, surprise people with a few of the things I've, I've got in store for Lagos. This is your first proper acting experience, you say? No, it's not, but it's like my first proper TV series. Right. So it's like my TV series debut. But short films, feature films, yeah, I've been there, done that. Sharon, how did you get this role? I really want to know. Who do you play? How did you get this role? What's up? I play Jola, who's Moye's best friend who is a bad girl, but well, you have to watch it to find out, so can't say much. So you guys are best friends and then you're now best friends by my side. I know, right? It's like art imitating life. It's the best thing. I want to know who you made out with. Can you tell me? I made out with Demi. Oh my goodness, is Demi a good kisser? He can, he can do better. He should come over for lessons, yeah. Can I come for lessons too? Yeah. The beautiful Osasi Godaro standing right next to me. How are you feeling? I'm good, how are you? I, well, let me not ask you because from the kisses all over your face, I'm sure he's doing great. Season one, what do you think about it? I think it's a great concept. I mean, it's all about the here and now, you know, young Lagosians trying to make it, you know, hip, cool people, kind of like myself, you know? <laughs> so it's, it's great. I loved it so much that I got excited about season two. I mean, I know quite a few people who are working in season one, and a few faces have come back again, so I'm excited to see what, you know, what has happened to those characters. I did watch season one. You did not watch season one. Okay, watch, this you know is... What that means? Yeah, yeah, that yeah. means I'm pumped up with season two. I'm no, that, that means you get a yellow card. Oh, I 
I'm expecting so much drama. I love season one. Season one was awesome. Um, and that was even before I started at Ndani. So. Um, I thought it was fantastic. It was great to see lots of my friends there. I think it's, it's fun and it's just nice to to see Lagos being represented in a cool, you know, really fly away. So I liked it. Oh, it was riveting. It was suspenseful. It was great. I loved it. And that's why I'm here supporting um, OC and Somkele. I'm very excited, you know. I'm obviously a big fan of the uh, series. You know, I watched the last season and, you know, I, I, I thought it was very interesting. Two episodes as well. Great. Especially the one that had uh, some of my music in it. So, you know, I was kind of listening now. So, yeah, it's cool, it's cool, it's great. I love I loved the premise, I love the storyline, I love the fact that it's about people in Lagos, young people in Lagos, and it applies to everybody. Nice and glossy, uh, which we've been expecting for a while, and yeah, it's, it's telling, telling contemporary Nigerian and Lagos stories as they unfold, so it's fantastic. So season two, what are your expectations, minimum? Okay, only the best. I mean, with Ndani, production quality, the story, everything is always top notch. When we first saw Giddy Up season one, everybody was just kind of like, their mind was literally blown away. So I'm hoping that the standard is going to be even better than last time. I'm really expecting to see a bit more drama. I want to see what happens to Polari because he was an evil guy and I don't like evil guys, but I'm really excited to see it. And um, the fact that it's now a 30 minute show, I know they're all super excited and I'm excited to watch it as well. I'm expecting them to take it further, you know, to take it there, you know, just um, to kill it. I'm hoping that it'll be explosive. I'm hoping that it'll be fashionable. And I'm hoping that it'll be awesome. I think season two should surprise me. And if not, I think season two is a flop, but I think I'll be surprised. So I am here to be surprised. I think it has more action, it has more finesse, it's, it's a double of everything. I want to spoil that towards the end of the season, <laughs> and since you know so much about Giddy Up, you just have to give us one. A spoiler? Yeah. Yo. Okay, um, first of all, Polari doesn't die. <laughs> so yes, um, yeah, so Polari comes back in season two, episode one, and by the end of the season, He's still there, so you got to watch out for Falari in season three. I have no spoiler. I could not do that. Tokuma grows up. I, I wish I could give you a spoiler. It's, it's so hard because some of the... Um, can I just pass on this? You can't do that. You have to tell me something. Even if you just say he dies, you have to say something. You understand, Abby? Okay, to be honest, um, people have been very economical with the content of season two. Mm -hmm. Even though I work here, <laughs> I really don't know. But I'm sure Valari is still going to be evil. Um, <laughs> Valari is still going to be evil. Do you know what you deserve right now? A red card. Everybody dies. Dude, I am on your side. Look, the only side you're on is yours. So you guys have seen a very exclusive snippet of Giddy Up Season 2. What do you feel about it? I think it's really good. I'm excited that we're producing our own content. And um, I, I thought the quality was really good too. And it was funny. Oh. Yep. And you? OK, it was really good. The director did a really good job of showing me how beautiful Lagos was. So that I really appreciate. The character build up too was amazing. And yeah, it's an amazing show. Yes, I haven't seen season one, but seeing this, I'm like, wow, wow. Well, um, it's a wonderful show, bright idea. I don't think they've ever gotten it this right. Yeah. We're trying to describe Lagos. Brilliant actors, brilliant content. I love it. Yeah, I love it. I love it. Like it was, it was great. I was like, oh wow. You know, I didn't expect that it would even be that 
you know, such such good quality. That's like international standard. Like it, it was really good. It was really good. I loved it. I loved it. To be honest, it's um, an amazing production. Production quality is amazing. Um, I think all the actors really nailed their parts. And the storyline is catchy. For someone that's never seen season one, I'm hooked already. Yeah, I was really, really impressed. I'm proud of every one of them, every single one of them. Well, I thank God that a day like this has come. Um, this has always been Jade's dream. And I bless God that it has happened today. I really congratulate her and her team for a very, very good job that they've done. I know it's taking them a lot of hard work, but I want to thank them also for supporting Jade to realize this dream. I think it's wonderful. It's a very nice evening. And I wish you, Indani TV, and this your series, Giddy Up, very well. Um, well, I've been waiting for it for a while, so this was a really good thing to be able to see it. I love the shot. It makes Lagos look really nice. I was telling my friend inside, I said, when people see this around the country, they're going to be like, everybody in Lagos is enjoying, oh my God, do people see how pretty your town is? So I think it's actually sending the message that it should be sending, which is, Lagos is full of life, it's full of dreams, it's full of expectations. It will give you everything that you're looking for. It might break your heart in the process, but you know, you will live. That's really what it's about. It's life. And I enjoyed it, every single moment of it. Oh, I think the build-up was very good. Um, the storyline is pretty interesting. Everybody had a lot of fun. Good picture quality, good acting from the cast and the crew. So it was a very great job. I mean, to GTV, to Jade Osibaru, good job. Loved it. I think it's pretty good. Um, I think it will do well um, and will definitely give, um, you know, a lot of the shows that are on TV right now a good run for their money. I think it's good. Yeah? Yeah. So I think there are places that are better than some, but I think it's good. Um, <laughs> wow. No, I can't say too much, can I? No, no spoilers, no spoilers. Just no, but there were a few scenes. Um, OB. Everyone's to watch out for Obi, right? Yeah, and how he pays back the money that they <laughs> used to treat him in hospital. I think that's going to be quite interesting. Oh, okay. So OCUKJ is a blast, isn't it? Yeah, I don't want to say too much though. But just make sure you watch it. But there, there were some times when everybody in the um, theater were just like, "Oh my God, no!" And big shout out to Some Killer as well and her little <clears throat> errors in judgment. <laughs> oh, okay, so I guess we have a lot to watch, right? Absolutely. I thoroughly really enjoyed it. Damn, I'm so sexy. I know, we're so beautiful. Oh my goodness. If I wasn't Arthur, I'd want to be us. Like, we're so Arthur. <laughs> Did I just say I was sexy? Well, You're I'm toying. Sexy. I'm toying, though. And I'm Onos. And um, we're going to watch the Giddy Up Season 2 premiere, yeah, right? And, and this is the end of the red carpet. Hi, I'm Onos. And if you did enjoy that video, which I know you did, you better subscribe to our channel and you can watch more videos too.